Hey, how's it going folks? ET here with another tutorial. In today's tutorial, we're going to be showing you how to do picture in a picture using DaVinci Resolve 15. Let's get started. We're going to go ahead and double click to open up an untitled project here. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and add some media and the way you do that, there's multiple ways, but let's go ahead and do it the following way. Go down to the bottom, the first icon will say media. Then in the top left corner over here, you can actually navigate through your computer to find that media. So we're going to go ahead and grab these three pieces of media and we're going to drop them down in here. Okay. Let's go ahead and change. All right. From here, we're going to click on the second icon. Now we can edit. Okay. So to do picture in a picture, you need either, you need a couple pieces of media, basically video images. Doesn't matter. Let's go ahead and start with some video. We're going to click on it, drag it into a timeline here. And we're going to go ahead and move it against so it's at the zero mark. Okay, I will go ahead and drag the audio down so we don't hear it. And let me close the inspector here. To do picture in a picture, you need another piece of media on top of the other piece of media. So we'll just grab this image here. And this image has a transparent background, but really doesn't matter what kind of photo you have or image. So we'll just drag it. And Resolve is going to go ahead and create us a new video track. So let's do that. But now it's not really picture in a picture. It's just an image with the transparent background of the, the old trusty Wii U. So to do our picture in a picture, you go ahead and select that top video track. And again, it can be an image or it can be video. And then you go up to this rectangle icon and click on that. What it's going to do is it's going to allow you to actually edit this layer here. So now we can actually resize it to make it bigger or smaller. So we'll just make it smaller, put it up here. Okay. And now if we play the clip, we have picture in a picture for a little bit and then it's going to disappear. And to take away these, this, these controls here, just go ahead and click on that icon again one more time. Okay. Let's go ahead and watch that one more time. So it pops in and then it pops out. If you want to add a little transition, a little fade in, you can grab the little tool at the top here, put a little fade in there and fade out if you like. Okay. So let's have a quick look. So a little fade in and a little fade out. Okay. So that was picture in a picture with an image. So let's go ahead and grab a piece of video. So what you're going to do is drag and aim for this empty spot here especially if your video has audio. Mm. Right, let's grab this one. Okay. So what it'll do is actually create that new track for you, both audio and video. So let's put it over here. So the track came over with both audio and video. If you want to get rid of the audio, you, you can right click and deselect the linked clips. Then from here you click on the audio only and then hit the backspace. Okay. So as before, the video on top kind of covers up the bottom one. So you'll notice the main video clip is playing. And then as soon as another clip is above it in the timeline, it covers it up. So what do you do? You click on the icon here and now you have control to make it smaller or bigger. So we'll make it smaller and then we'll throw it in a corner. Okay. And then we'll deselect and let's have a look. Okay. There we go. All right. So that's basically how you do picture in a picture. Okay. I think that's going to be it for today's tutorial. As usual, don't forget peace and aloha.